thank you for joining this lesson. I'm going to take you through a question on GP. GP is geometric progression. A subtopic in sequences and series whereby we study terms in which to get the next term we use a common ratio. Therefore, here we are given a question which talks of the average of the first and the fourth terms of a GP is 140. Then we are told, given that the first term is 64, find the common ratio. Therefore, the common ratio has not been given. We are given the first term is 64, and we are further told that the average of the first term and the fourth term gives us 140. Okay, we know that any other term, any other term is given by A, where A is the first term times R, then raised to N minus 1, such that if we are getting the first term, we just write A, and for us to get the fourth term, then we will take A, then R, raised to 4 minus 1, which will be a r cubed. Therefore, a r cubed is the fourth term, and the first term is a. Now, we are being told that the average of the first and the fourth terms of a GP is 140. That means when we take the first term and we add the fourth term, then we divide them by 2, we get 140. We get 140. The first term is given as 64, therefore here we have 64. So 64 plus 64, r power 3 equals to 140, when this one has been divided by 2. Therefore the average of the first term is 64, and the fourth term, which is 64 r cubed, when we divide them by 2, that means now taking the average, they should give us 140. Therefore, here we can have 64 plus 64R cubed equals to 140 by 2, which gives us to 80, which gives us to 80. Therefore, 64R will give us to 80 less 64. And this will be 216. We can divide by 64 through to remain with R cubed. When we take 216 and we divide with 64, we remain with 3.375. Therefore, we can get R by taking cube root. And when we take cubes, we have 1.5. Therefore, R will be 1.5. So the most important thing when we come to geometric sequences and series is interpretation of the question. Because when we are told that the average of the first and the fourth term, then our students should be aware that we are being told when we take the first term, which is A, and then we add the fourth term, then we divide by 2, we get 140. Then from there, because the first term is provided as 64, we can substitute 64 and we learn at the answer. Thank you for following. Subscribe to the channel and share the link.